the whole story. So back when we lived in St Andrews, we had a big upstairs lounge room because it's back it's in St Andrews where a huge um, multi-acre property with a big house only costs about two hundred and seventy thousand dollars. So in, when we lived in St Andrews, we had a big spare lounge room, and that's where we could we had an upper room for a table tennis table and a pool table. But then when we moved to Diamond Creek, we didn't have enough room for either of them, and so we just put them in the garage. We just let them, we just closed them up and left them in there. And over the years, rainwater getting into the garage has meant that both the table tennis table and the pool table have just eroded. So the table tennis table that we have from we, we, we got from St Andrews doesn't stand up on its own. The, the feet, the metal feet, have been so eroded that uh, it actually just collapses on its own weight. So yeah, the only way to, keep, to make that table tennis stable stand up anymore would be to have some sort of large substitute legs. Mm -hmm. So other than that, it's pretty much useless. So we don't have a table tennis table anymore. Which is a real shame. Look at them. They, they're in the they have a girlfriend. Mm. Look at them. It's like, this is my girlfriend. Stay away from them. Really? Is that what they're doing? Yeah, look at them. So I still have all the table tennis stuff, I still have all the bats, the rackets, the paddles, and I still have lots of balls. Oh, that's a steep ball.